R.I.P. Onigiri. Just blew up and hit the Rotom. Thank you. Guys, can we get one more Fs in chat spam? For our boys in multicoloredness. Well, all's in a day's work. Their sacrifice will not be in vain. Maybe. Maybe not. Who's to say? Who's to say, you know? All right. Overquill died first. At least Overquill did his job and didn't waste our normal gem. So we can blow up with somebody else. I want my Dracloak. I want my, I want my Dragapult. I want my Draco Dragapult. What's final move set on this? Dragon Darts, Draco, Meteor, Phantom Force, and Will-O-Wisp. I'm a sucker for you. No, wow. Yeah, okay. We do Phantom Force instead of Shadow Ball, huh? Ooh, I'm a rebel just for kicks, yeah. I've been feeling since the 90s. I won't forget the Everstone. Thank you. Come to me, Dragapult. Um, what's the goal for, for Magma Hideout? I probably delay for like one of the the past the things in the back, right? So it's probably a good good as place as any to end it. Crikey! As a beauty if I ever should say one. Ooh, I'm a rebel just for kid! Holy sh! Flygon can learn U-turn? Oh my god, I just creamed my pants. This is amazing! So, room one gives me a really good chance at Gramble because I have all of these dupes. Would have all of these dupes. But do I really roll another Wheezing Boom? Yeah, because it'll have Explosion, Flamethrower, Pain Split, and Sludge Bomb. So that gives me really good chance at a fairy type. Room two is good for Groudon, but Eggy can explode. Oh yeah, I guess I don't have a Chlorophyll Mon. Yeah, um, the thing about Ments is that I do get guaranteed Ments. Um, am I crazy? Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm get guaranteed Ments here. I did not get Game Corner, no. I get Game Corner, but, well, I have Dreepy. So I would get Gibble Gumi Jing Mo O here if I wait for Mind Badge. I could get Dratini Big on Dano. But again, I have guaranteed Mints. Ooh, look at these teams. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. They're labeled. I don't know why I'm counting. Fourteen, fifteen, fourteen battles before Tabitha. <laughs> Oh, what is this sh <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Holy hell. Maxi is free, just get a lowland egg. Well, I mean, we used up our cost app berry, so it wouldn't even matter. So this, none of these are guaranteed to be chlorophyll, but it gives me a shot. I could also get Doom, Volcarona, or Charmander if I go rooms two through four. That's probably better and safer than going for this sh So I would love Exadrill and Hydreigon's pretty heat. And Garchomp, obviously. I have the Garchomp height, too. Yeah, man, let's just hope that this cast form can actually kill this thing. Electrode, Grass, Gem, Solar Beam. Oh my god. This guy sucks. Even then, it doesn't kill. And we're a perfect IV. Yeah, yeah, the level. Yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> oh, great. Then it only almost always kills. <laughs> <laughs> like three or, three or four trainers in room one. Well, if we're lucky next stream, which will probably be Thursday, we'll get the encounter. So we're doing, we're doing Mount Pyre. No, 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 sorry. We're doing Magma Hideout today. Um, part of it. Anyways, there's like a bajillion of these, um, these guys. There's 15 of them. Yeah, so, yeah, we do have a Bright Powder fella here. Uh, we got Bright Powder Charizard, but this is Physical Charizard, and Physical Charizard gets absolutely just dunked on by our uh, Aerodactyl. 
Um, the one I'm really worried about is this uh, Tauros. This Tauros is kind of a douche. This Gramble, so um, the norm, what we've normally done with Torkoal leads is we've used um, Vivion here to just compound eyes. I'm sorry, to just powder this and kill him. The issue is that this, well, there's a couple issues. It has Quick Claw, but the more important issue is that 210 is not divisible by four. So if we powder four times on the fifth time, there's a chance that it Quick Claw explosions when it's under 10 because it sees slow kill, which is nine or 11, and explosion is 10. Now there's a good chance that it explodes, which it wouldn't be the end of the world if we just protected, but I don't know. It's it's not my uh, it's not my favorite. Arcanine is pretty good here if we can hit a head smash right, and we can wide lens this, and make it what 93% chance. Explosion doesn't kill. If we miss out on the kill, we can always just extreme speed on the next turn. It'll never shell smash. So I kind of like Arcanine. I mean, best case scenario, we hit both these rolls. Things get a little sketchy if we don't, but at the very least, it's just going Solar Beam or Explosion. I wonder if, um, wonder how Drag uh, Dragapult actually does here. Ah, oh, I mean, yeah, we could just Dragon Pulse and Draco drop this sucker, right? Oh man, we get to use Dragapult. I guess I can put Dragon Darts on this bastard. It's gonna be sad when he dies before he's good, huh? That would be a whoopsie doopsie, huh? Wow, this might be the first time I've ever used a Dragapult not on ladder. Oh, you know what? I have used it in um, Pokemon Emerald Rogue. Do you think you could rank your five mons that surprised you the most this run? Is that with a rank five? Man, making me do mental labor. The ones that surprised me the most. Vivian definitely won. Um, Kingler 2. I've been very, do you mean pleasantly surprised? Because you know what has underwhelmed me? This guy sucked. This was big underwhelming energy. I can put that on there. Muck surprised me at how bad it was. Um, I've been, I'm, honestly, I've been very surprised by Flygon. That's four. Like, Flygon has consistently been extremely good, and I'm, I'm kind of surprised um, since it's not a particularly good Pokemon. And five, I don't know. Honestly, Pidgeot. Pidgeot. All right. Um, This should be okay. When Team Magma has roll call, we get important guarding assignments in the order that we line up. That's why I'm stuck off in this corner. I'm always late to roll call. A little bit of magma lore for you guys there. Learning the in and outs of the magma trade, as it were. How, how, how neat. Drought! Ah. Ah. Oh, I forgot to give it dragon darts. Cool. You know, chat, I don't understand why it did that. <laughs> I thought it would never, why would it do that? And this is fine, we can just sucker punch it now, but um, that, that messes up my routing, so I just gotta make sense. I don't understand why it did that. All right, Shell Smash starts at plus six. If player mon is incapacitated, which it's not as plus three. If player mon cannot KO AI mon if shell smash is used this turn, plus two. If player mon can KO AI mon if shell Ma smash is used this turn, additional minus two. Does it take into account that it sees that I'm faster, so it'll just do it? That's so wild. That's so wiggy weird. It may still be better. I mean, we take 30% with flare blasts, uh, with fire blast. Because basically, if um, if Dragapult comes in, Tauros is using Play Rough. Tauros comes in, which isn't the end of the world. If it, if, I, if it uses Play Rough, then Togedemaru instantly takes 38%, which I don't love. Arc needs to always bait, so we can't take more than 21%. But we do have Citrus. This crit on this fire blast would be Malo, right? 
Still fine. Yeah, let's let's just go Arcanine here. That <laughs> missed. Never punished. Okay, cool. Um, yeah, we just extreme speed to kill this Torkoal now. We're back on track. So that actually helps. Um, although, is this not kind of an issue? Because actually now Charizard doesn't see the kill, right? <laughs> so it's actually going to go Gramble anyways. Ugh, that's actually annoying. Oh. Oh, no, no, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Head smash here is fine. Is that fine? Okay, whatever. Um... We've got, we've got plenty of outs here. Go ahead. Howl, coward. I suppose this could be random move from from Tauros, which sucks, but at least it's never Fire Blast or Body Frost. Yeah. Uh, not, 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 not ideal. Because uh, Tauros is faster. Tauros now sees kill with... From 134, could be Iron Tail, could be Play Rough, could be Body Slam. But at least it's never Flare Blade. Man, that miss is actually kind of annoying. Oh, f me. I did not give this Wide Lens, did I? That was a goof. Ah. Whoops. All right, slow it down. <laughs> That's worst case scenario. And that miss really f***ed me over. So going Fire Blast for now. Well, I mean, it's random move. It's Fire Blast or Body Slam. But for another Fire Blast. I could I could always go Dragapult. And then just take the kill, right? Um, Who comes out after that? So we killed... We, we still have Gramble. We're going to kill the Torkoal. You've got Earthquake. Ah. You go play rough, but then we can just go... Yeah, 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 yeah. Should be okay. Should be okay. Worst case, we take a Body Slam on Arc. Mm. All right. Arcanine does not want to be hit by a, uh... If I stay in here, since I didn't take any damage, take 46% from Iron Tail, still baits Earthquake on you. Yeah. Yeah. Can't get defense dropped here. Can always come in on a switch. Trigger Citrus Berry if this, if this crits. Doo -doo. Right. Just can't get defense drop. This is sheer force. It's going to do a decent amount, but not enough. All right. <sighs> now's the fun part. We could eternally miss rock slides here, I guess. There's Charizard. Um, this is Blaze, not Solar Power. Interesting. But we would have to miss a bunch of these for this to matter. And we don't miss any. Nice. Okay. Um, all right. So last is Gramble. Gramble's going play rough. So H&R block. Lose a Citrus Berry here, but I think we were always losing the Citrus Berry. Doo-doo. All right. Bye, Citrus Berry. 
when you get Mega Aerodactyl. I don't think we get it until um, the uh, Victory Road, right? <clears throat> All right, my boy Lem is back. My boy Lem is back with his bullshit. Now we can just powder this. This only barely ever sees the kill with Fire Punch. So now we just powder until this kills itself. I think after Tate and Liza it is available. Hell yeah. Okay, I was wrong. Whatever. Where, um... Where do you get Swamperite? Swamper tight. Oh, yo, this is divisible by four, too, so it's only going to take four. Sorry, Gramble. We could risk the uh, the sunny miss on a hurricane. <laughs> Are you tracking how many kills each Mon gets? I'm not, no. Swamperite. Swamper tight is victory road. I see. Good job, Vivian! Yay, Vivian! All right, that's one down. Now we return to five hours of happy and upbeat Pokemon music as a Nader re upload. Next trainer. That could have gone better, but ooh, a focus band Agron. Sure, why not? Is there a speed run where once you get the Mac bike or the Acro bike, you can't do anything but this? I wonder what the speed time is for, for bouncing. Ooh, what's up here? Oh, hell yeah. Is this the camera up that I didn't get? Yeah, cool. That would, that'd be fun. Um, sorry, we missed out on the lore there. I wasn't paying attention. I was too busy thinking about my own ego. So, um, great. I mean, let's just go ahead and Mega Evolve and knock off. Yeah. Um, give me them rocks, you big dumb dummy. Give me the rocks. Give me the beat, boy, and free my soul. I want to get lost in your rock and roll and drift away. Thanks. Okay, cool. That helps. Cool. McLaughlin. McLaughlin. Greatest dog this side of the Mississippi. Uh, now what do we do? We go man bun on the, the uh, heavy slam, right? Come on and slam! Welcome to the jam! Oh, sh hold on. Is that going to be an issue? No, it's not going to be an issue. Cool. Can I brick break just for fun? Like, nope, nope, that wouldn't kill. Bye. Come on and slam! And welcome to the jam! Okay, so wild charge still kills, which is good. Uh, well, it still sees it kills. It doesn't always kill. So we just roll it here now. No. All right. Poison, pointed sp stones, whatever the f and then tea cake here. Um, I just got to actually make sure I should make sure I don't accidentally kill this with liquidation, right? Liquidation does at most 78%. Yep. Classic moron move. Classic moron move from the AI using Magnet Rise so that it doesn't die. Classic moron move. All right, this should always be cross poison, uh, cross chop, so we can go Shelly Ann, and then we just kill the rest of this team, <laughs> which is pretty nuts. Oh my God! Wait, that was adorable. Oh man, I missed it. Yeah, so we kill all of these guys. So it should just go Seviper. Yep. Um, the only thing this will do... It could poison me with Gunk Shot, I guess. But we'll uh, cross that bridge if and when we get there. <laughs> it did Quick Claw. 
Damn. You psychopath. It went Earthquake, though, which is usually highest roll. Yeah, all right. Problem solved. Break. Oh, I keep missing it. <laughs> I love it. Oh, man. That's adorable. Okay. Um, this should go Dragapult. Um, Phantom Force is 84%, but Homie just took 25% from his own Stealth Rock, so we just go Phantom Force. Um, this, I'd imagine, will never go Substitute, but even if it does, we have Infiltrator. So, goodbye. Um, and then last is Houndoom, who also dies to Dragon Darts because of those Stealth Rocks. Cool. Cool. Okay, well, that's that guy defeated. Um, great. How did you get so far on your first attempt? Uh, well, I was born to my parents as a gift from God himself or herself. We don't really know. And then 29 years later, I decided to play a game for children that was modded by some crazy man. Um, and it tested my skills and my strengths, but um, there is no equal to me for as previously mentioned, I am a gift from God themselves onto this world. So that's how I'm getting so far. It's basically because I'm literally the greatest person to do anything ever. If you dispute that, I will have my creator smite you. All that and humble too. That's what I'm saying. Honestly, if there's something that I'm good at, like if 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 there if I had to pick one thing that I was best at, it would be being humble. Professor Oak, I don't know if there's any proof anywhere that you need a PhD to be a professor. Didn't didn't Sword and Shield? I mean, I know it's it's a little different because Galar is British, so like no rules. But like, didn't didn't they just let Sonya be a professor at the end? I think the only qualifier is wearing a lab coat. Yeah, I mean, you certainly don't need an undershirt. We've seen Kukui. So this is what we're going for. We're going for one of these homies. How much One Piece would you read for $5? I would read one um, volume. I don't know. I don't know what they're called. I think Dragapult is right so that I can just safely switch... What are we going for? Um, a Groudon counter. But really, just a friend. As usual, we just want a friend. That is a friend. That's a great friend, I think. Um, at least it can't blow up. One ball HG, baby, LFG. I feel like quick balls are broken in this game. They don't work, I'm convinced. Quick balls don't work. We could do a veggie bun, that's cute. Veggie bun. All right, Victory Bell, mild, plus special attack. Oh, she's hitting those leaf storms, baby. L, oh, man. <laughs> oh, come on. What is this, sh Victory Bell? <laughs> let's uh let's let's throw it in the calc and see i i think that'll that'll still work if not we have to um use our candy or something but all right moment of truth let's see if he one shots with a grass gem oh hell yeah dude we don't even need to burn a grass gem let me just do miracle seed probably okay well we i guess we have to do life orb but look at that we had two if we had two it's a guaranteed one shot with Miracle Seed. But we don't have to we don't have to waste grass gem. So that's cool. Yeah, no, Evoch, you're you're good. We we have your app. 
All right, McLaughlin. McLaughlin doesn't get killed by anything from Nido King. So Nido King is always going to Stealth Rock. So we're always going to knock it off. Knock off the focus band, that is. And then uh, then take the kill with a uh, SP. Okay. Is that bad? No. No, no, no. That's not bad. That's totally fine. Oh! Wait, what? Why did it do that? It should always stealth rock there. What, what, what am I missing? It sees me as normal Absol? No sh**. Okay, I know that. Sorry for being sassy. Preemptively. No sh**. But also, normal Absol has the same f***ing defense and HP. I know you're trying to be helpful, so I'm sorry for being sassy. But it doesn't, it, it doesn't see the kill. I don't know why it did that. It should always do that. First turn out, plus eight, plus nine. Oh, damn it. <laughs> oh, okay, it's just really unlikely. I, I, I've been playing under the fact that it always does it. That's dangerous. I've been getting lucky there. So it has to go plus eight here, 20%. So it's 20%. Yeah, it's just super, super unlikely. So it has to roll 20% for highest damage roll. And then it has to go 25%. So it's 20%, 25%, ah, 50%. Uh, yeah, it's a 2.5% chance. That's wild. Um, all right, time to... Um, I kind of got to steer a little bit now. Hold on. So the issue, no, 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 no. This should be fine. It'll go Aerodactyl. It'll go random move on Aerodactyl, but it will go Aerodactyl. This is Earthquake, Poison Jab, or Ice Punch. So I can't go to anything else. Can't go Dragapult. Could go Kingler, but if, it go, if I come in on Earthquake, that's a problem. But the alternative is... Aerodactyl, this could go anything as well. Earthquake, Rock Blast, Dual Wing Beat, or Fire Fang. But Aerodactyl is weaker than Nitto King. Oh, no, they're the same. How much does Ice Punch do to my Aerodactyl? I mean, it could just set up Stealth Rocks. Or actually, it'll never set up Stealth Rocks now, right? Um, Because I have the Magic Bounce. Okay, so I could go Arrow here. What is Arrow's roll? Uh, Arrow's roll was baiting the... Uh, I really can't go Arrow. Well, I could, but at this point, we're kind of risking a bunch anyways, right? This should always go Aerodactyl. It's, it's faster. It sees the kill. So we then go Swamper. But yeah, not having Stealth Rocks up makes the Aerodactyl matchup a little weaker. Especially because I went Citrus Berry on the uh, Kingler. Yeah. Okay, Fire Fang is actually ideal as long as it doesn't burn. Nice. Okay, so this is always Dual Wing Beat. So we now always go Pretzel. Aerodactyl takes how much from this? Should be a lot. Not enough. I think we need to do this one more time, but then the issue is that we could get get burned. So I can go I can go my own Bella. I think I unfortunately might need to um risk a burn on Kingler and I'm in a bit of trouble. <laughs> I can't believe, I can't believe that happened. That's wild.
Uh, this isn't ideal. So now, unfortunately, this could bait Fire Fang instead of just Earthquake. So if Kingler gets burned on the Fire Fang switch, we're in a bit of a <laughs> we're in a bit of trouble. Um, well, maybe not because we can always fake out here. I needed Mystic Water. See, it could now go for Fire Fang. But that's really nice, because now I think even with the burn, Aqua Jet probably kills. Uh, oh, no, it's tight, but we may have to roll that. Okay. Okay. All right, Kingler. The alternative is I go back to Tea Cake then come in on dual wing beat. Or I go Legat. How much does Rock Blast do? I think Rock Blast does too much because if it hits five times, uh, Rock Blast never kills. I mean, Bannister also can potentially play around. I guess I guess we'll just see. We I think we I think we go Bannister here. Do I get punished? I do not get punished. Okay. Okay, so let's just make sure we're at 131. Aqua Jet kills. All right, so slacking is going retaliate or double edge here. The issue though now, the problem. <laughs> So the issue is that now if I uh, hit this thing's eject button with Slay King on Slay King, it's actually going to go camera up because it'll see that we kill Zorua. So it'll never want to do that. So it'll have to go camera up because we don't see the kill on camera up. And then that could just that then that has the chance to explode. So I can always protect here and get a safe switch to Legat, and then Legat can hit it. Does that do anything? No. I can go Pretzel, but I think Pretzel then just gets pursued and killed. So that doesn't work either. And I can't go McLaughlin. Oh man, I think I'm I think I'm a little I can I can I can do Kingler. I can just protect, I can Aqua Jet. That brings out Zorua. Zerua wants to go Focus Blast. Always here, right? Doesn't see the kill with Pursuit. Even if it does, it won't crit kill. Or it won't kill as long as it doesn't crit. Um, so it always goes Focus Blast because it doesn't go you. Yeah. And then that gives me the safe switch. Sludge Bomb never kills Kingler. So now we can hit this with a big fat crab hammer. That's going to feel good. We don't ice hammer. And then that triggers a eject button. So Zorua comes out. It'll look like camera upped. We're not pulling a Mac wacko slash moxie, a Mako. Oh man, well that's interesting. <laughs> oh gee, I want so weird. This has two Slay Kings. Um, so this always goes Focus Blast now. So uh, then we can just go Dragapult, Draco Meteor. Um, though that baits Crunch from Slay King, and I have no switch into that. Oh, never mind. No, I, I can just go Kingler, and then yeah, Profit. Okay, great. Okay. All right, add another tick to the counter. We're dropping Dracos like it's our business. Is this going the stupid cow? No, no, no. It should. It should go. It should go. Uh, it should go slaking. But I think even if it went the stupid cow, it's fine. <laughs> This always goes crunch. So we Draco dip into 
you crunch crit. Uh, we're losing a citrus berry here, but crunch crit does 108. Bannister then just attacks when we need to attack. Yeah, yeah, okay, we got it, we got it, we got it. Okay. Hit my knee. Not risking that. Man, 2.5% chance to not go Stealth Rock on turn one. Pretty wild. Man, if that had happened... If that had happened against the Garchomp... I would have been so in that May fight. This has Quick Claw, the camera upped. But uh, we can just Aqua Jet. Quick Claw doesn't go over Aqua Jet Pryo, and it guaranteed this the kill here. Okay. Like, would I have just wiped? I think so. I think I would have wiped if that happened during the May fight. I don't think I would have been able to beat the uh, Articuno. Like, I would have had to sack something. Just so you know. Survived at one. Because, yeah, had that happened, I wouldn't have gotten the, the damage up and Absol didn't outspeed. So I would have probably had to, like, sack Absol to do damage with Sucker Punch. And then I don't even remember what else I had left. And that would have just been that guy. Like, yeah, we probably would have wiped.